Hello guys, welcome to BTEC Tutorials. Today we're gonna discuss the issue of engineering status in India. So first of all, let us focus on what is the current status of employment in India. So we all know that unemployment has increased in a drastic rate as we can see. Now why this unemployment has increased? The reason behind that is the supply is more much more than the demand the number of engineers graduating each and every year passing out each and every year they don't just don't have enough jobs from them for this the AICTE of India has come up with new engineering rules for the year 2018 they have introduced new rules and this new rules are surely certainly gonna help us getting achieving that employment rate for which we have been waiting from years and uh, let us see what are the rules they have specified let us focus first of all the first rule is the equality in syllabus rule now the Indian education system is changing and the first they have specified some new rules they have brought up some new ideas so that we can cope with this problem of unemployment the first rule as I said in equality in syllabus now what is this rule this rule states that the syllabus throughout the whole nation throughout all the institutes and colleges of India they're gonna have a common syllabus for engineering like earlier we had different syllabus for different institute every single institute whether it's autonomous non-autonomous belonging to different parts of our nation they had different set of syllabus but now it's gonna be a same syllabus rule no matter it's IIT NIT the local college private or government college it doesn't matter they all gonna have same syllabus this will help us while we go for a job, while we apply for a job. Next rule is the internship rule. Now, what is this rule? Let's see. As we all know, earlier days, we, the students of engineering, they had to approach on their own for internship. They approached, they wrote their resumes. They did all by themselves for getting internship. Now, this will be done by the institute or college the institute and college itself they're gonna help the students for getting internship they're gonna teach them how to write resumes they're gonna send their resumes and thus they're gonna provide internship and in return they're gonna get certified they're gonna get the certificates and thus will help in placement next rule they have specified Yes, this rule has been in has been there in the engineering career, in the engineering course, that attendance rule. As we all know, this attendance policy, this attendance policy of 75% attendance has been there since the start of the engineering rules. But now this has been changed. What changes have been made? That the 75 attendance is made compulsory. Not only that, but this compulsion will be followed strictly as there are many cases of fake attendance proxies and you know altering the system official system but this all malpractices will be stopped as it will be strictly followed and strictly noted next rule is the credit score as we all know we follow a certain credit, uh, credit score rule the CGP and SGPAs we all have been following and certain credit score for different institutes now this credit score rule has brought has been brought under some drastic changes now what are the changes changes are that these changes will be focusing on individual subjects and the development of the student in that particular subject Next is the mostly study on practical basis 
now it has been complained from since the start of the time that indian education system doesn't focuses on practical approach now this will be solved uh, finally they have heard us and from now on syllabus will be totally based on practical approach this will increase the chances of employment also the colleges are made mandatory to invest 1% of their total budget the entire college budget will uh, now consist 1% of them will be invested in training and placement cell training and placement cell will be formed in each and every institute this cell this special department will handle all our placements on and off campus interviews and on and off campus recruitments now this training and placement cell will be made mandatory in each and every institute and will be well funded by the institute itself so that we don't have to worry about all the placement and we'll be trained for it thanks for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it and i hope you got some quality as content like share and subscribe for more such videos